The Book of Romans, chapter one, verses twenty-two to thirty-two. Professing themselves to be wise, they became fools and traded the glory of the incorruptible God for the likeness of the image of the corruptible man, and of birds and four-footed animals and creeping things. Therefore, God also gave them up in the lust of their hearts to their uncleanness, that their bodies should be dishonored among themselves, who exchanged the truth of God for a lie. And worshipped and served the creature rather than the Creator, who is blessed for ever. Amen. For this reason, God gave them up to vile passions. For their women changed the natural functions into that which is against nature. Likewise, also the men, leaving the natural functions of a woman, burn in their lust to one another. Men doing what is inappropriate with men. And receiving in themselves the due penalty of their error, even as they refused to have God in their knowledge, God gave them up to the reprobate mind to do those things which are not fitting, being filled with all unrighteousness, sexual immorality, wickedness, covetousness, malice, full of envy, murder, strife, deceit, evil habits. Secret slanderers, backbiters, hateful to God, insolent, arrogant, boastful, inventor of evil things, disobedient to parents, without understanding, covetous breakers, without natural affection, unforgiving, unmerciful, who, knowing the ordinance of God, that those who practice such things are worthy of death. Not only do the same, but also prove those who practice them.